about Don Rogelio and Doña Isolina, there is rather little that I can say. They lived in the countryside, in La Quebrada, near Marchiwe, in the Ohains region, where my father and his three brothers were born, Domingo, Pablo and Alvaro. Later on all, but one of them went to the capital, making us and my cousins the first generation, even in university studies, and me the only doctor, although in letters, of course, maybe also in this complicated matter of immigration to another South, which has so much in common, even if they laugh and deny it, criticize me, there in my homeland. So that despite the sorrows, I've always felt that I'm already back there, or that I never left. Of Don Rogelio, I remember him to pick us up at the train station in a one-horse coach, mm -hmm. and that he then set me astride a great percheron and lead me around the yard. They say that he was proud of that infant who in the long run would resemble him. Of Doña Isolina, I remember that as soon as she found out who would be there visiting, she slaughtered a lamb and she fixed up the best room and that she enjoyed calling my brother Marcelito. So I deduced that we were scattered about with no preferences in the world of their affections.